Maddie, and I'm a Lincoln Fire and Rescue Fire Explorer. Fire Explorer shout out to the fire department, and today I'm here to show you my gear. First, I'm going to start with my boots. As you can see, there is something called a hood sock in my boot. A hood sock is something that protects you from heat and hot water, and it protects your neck. Now I'm going to slide off my boots and put on the ones that firefighters use in fire structure fires. These boots are special. They have what's called a steel toe. A steel toe protects something from falling onto your foot and it protects you from getting injured. Now, these suspenders help keep your pants up while you're fighting fire. Next, I'm going to show you my coat. My coat has three layers, a thermal layer, a water barrier, a warm moisture barrier, and a, an outer shell. These are the three layers. The layers are just like oven mitts. They protect you from heat. Here's an oven mitt and here's the inside of my coat. The, um, the oven mitt is something that your parents will use to take it to take things out of the oven. There are many different ways to close your coat. First, you start with the buckles, and then you do the velcro. Next, I'm going to talk about my helmet. My helmet is very rough and hard. The reason why it is like this is because if something were to fall onto a firefighter's head, the helmet would protect the firefighter. Next is the back. The back helps avoid and deflect moisture and water from coming down onto your neck and back. Next is the gloves. The gloves are something that firefighters use to protect their hands from heat and hot water. Now I'm going to talk about some fire safety tips. First thing is stop, drop, and roll. You'd use this if your clothing caught on fire. First you stop, you drop, and then you roll. While you're doing this, you want to make sure that your face is covered by your hands. Once the fire is out, you can eventually stop. Next, if you ever find a lighter or a match on the ground, make sure you tell a trusted adult to come and pick it up. Do not play with the light, lighter or match and make sure that the adult knows that it's there. Now I'm going to quiz you. First thing is, what are the three layers of my coat and pants? Why is my helmet shaped the way that it is? What do you do if you ever find a match or a lighter on the ground? And last but not least, what do you do if your clothing caught on fire? Now I'm now I want to make sure that you guys are practicing social distancing by staying six feet away from people and washing your hands for at least 20 seconds. Thank you guys for watching.